is self-love real? I'm going to be honest, I didn't always believe that self-love was real love. I used to think it was an instinctual thing like self-preservation. In fact, I thought that healthy self-love was exactly that, the sense of self-preservation that we all possess. And as for all those people that went on yammering about loving themselves all the time, well, to me, that was a form of arrogance. They were just divas or something. Being that I grew up in a humble Latino household, I've never been a fan of arrogance. It wasn't until about six years ago when I was doing some shadow work to undo the toll that many years of body shaming had taken on my psyche and sense of self-worth that I came face to face, rather abruptly I might add, with palpable, authentic self-love. Not self-preservation, mind you, which is the instinctual will to survive that is present in all humans and animals. I'm talking full on, tangible, real deal love that you can actually feel. Hola chicas poderosas, I'm Mari Rosa, self-love trainer, and this is my YouTube channel, Chica Power, where you learn how to fall in love with yourself first. The day that I came face to face with self-love, I remember I was on my way to work and I was listening to the Warrior Goddess Training audiobook by Heather Ash Amara. See the link in my description. And there was a section about opening your heart. I thought it was going to be about opening your heart up to others, which is something that I've really never had a problem doing. And I was right to some extent. A lot of it was about that. But then she introduced self-love in such a way that literally blew my mind and changed my life forever. In this short video, I'm going to introduce you to self-love via an exercise that's going to feel wonderful. So make sure you listen until the end. take a minute here and ask a favor. If you like this video and find it helpful, please, por favor, hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and ring the bell so you get notified every time I upload a new video. One of the wonderful things about love is that we have unlimited reserves of it. So in order to love ourselves more, you do not have to diminish the love that you feel for others. All you need to do is cultivate your self-love. Watch my Falling in Love with Yourself 6 Fundamental Steps video. Today, I'm going to show you how to feel that love. Are you ready, chicas? So you want to find a comfortable place to sit or lay down. Pause the video if you need a minute or two to get comfortable. Take a deep breath in counting to four. One, two, three, four. Now slowly exhale, counting to four. One, two, three, four. Close your eyes. Let's do that two more times, concentrating on your breath each time. In. One, two, three, four, out. One, two, three, four, in. One, two, three, four, out. One, two, three, four. Now bring to your mind's eye the image of someone you love unconditionally. It could be your son, your daughter, your baby, your partner, your dog, your cat. Picture that someone you love looking lovingly back at you and let your love 
flow out of your heart for that special someone. Feel those strong feelings, that warmth coming out of you. What you are feeling right now, that is your love for that person. That love doesn't come from outside of you. It comes from inside of you, from your heart. Visualize your love as a warm golden light coming out of your heart and enveloping your special someone so that they are bathed in the light. Now keep those feelings present. And now remove the image of your special someone and picture yourself your mirror image and continue to let those feelings flow out of your heart. Only now they are flowing out and onto yourself. They are coming out of your heart and bathing your own self with that warm golden light. Imagine what that feels like like you're standing in the warm afternoon sunlight. Revel in the warmth and light for a bit. Now smile from ear to ear. Feel your smile feed into the warm light of your love and turn it up a notch. Feel all that love humming like Luke Skywalker's lightsaber. Now reach your arms around yourself and give yourself a slow, firm hug. You can rock back and forth a little bit if that feels good. Feel the warmth and say, I love myself. Say it again. I love myself. One more time louder this time as you hug yourself a little bit tighter. I love myself. Take a deep breath. One, two, three, four, and exhale. One, two, three, four. Slowly bring your arms down and open your eyes. Did you feel that? Yes, I bet you did. Now, didn't that feel good? Well, if you had any doubts before, now you know for sure that self-love is real, it's palpable, and it's wonderful. You can come back and do this short self-love meditation anytime you want. You can make it longer. In fact, I recommend that you try and do it every day. Well, that's it for today, chicas. If you've been watching my videos, you know that I like to end with a refrain which is a wise Latina saying or adage. Today's nugget of wisdom is donde hay querer, todo se hace bien, which translates into where there is love, everything is done well. You will do well to love yourselves, chicas poderosas. You are all beautiful, uniquely special, and deserve to love yourselves as much as you love the special people in your lives. Take the time to practice and cultivate self-love, and everything else in your life will fall into place. I hope you enjoyed this video. If so, give it a like, subscribe to my channel, and please, please give me your feedback in the comments. I will continue to take a deep dive into the prolific topic of self-love in the next few weeks, so stay tuned. Besos y abrazos a todas. Hugs and kisses to all. Mwah.